All right, we all know the Hokies are on a short week trying to avoid the dreaded letdown game, welcoming William and Mary to Lane Stadium, carrying a number 12 national ranking after that win at Florida State. Pick it up in the first quarter. The Tribe quarterback is Sean Mitchell. He is sacked by Hoshan Gaines. He fumbles on the play, recovered by Virginia Tech. Ensuing drive, the pride of Galax, Stephen Peoples pinballing in from six yards out to go up 7-0. Second quarter, Josh Jackson, quarterback keep. Some help from his O-line, and he's eventually in the zone to extend their lead to 24 nothing. Later, William & Mary going to get on the board. Direct snap, Nate Evans takes it to the house to cut the lead to 24-7. But hold on, Hokies offense can land it on to Sean McLeese. Punching it in from short yardage for the touchdown. Virginia Tech rolls at home 62-17. Anytime a team scores 62 points, the offense is obviously doing something right. But despite the Hokies racking up 582 yards of total offense, Josh Jackson says there's still room to improve. We had a couple of fumbles, even though um, you know one wasn't uh, was recovered back by us. I think there's things that we need to get better at. But putting up points like that, running the ball like how we did, is very important. And it's um, good to see guys um, get, get in and get those type of reps. When the team's doing what they're supposed to do, all 11 guys doing their job, we can make big plays and keep them off, keep the punt off the field. So and we were just hot. Everybody was turning up first um, home game opener. Everybody was doing their job. After taking a big lead in the second quarter, the Hokies backups got plenty of reps. The coaches were happy to be able to rotate so many young guys in. Can I stress to them at halftime that the next 30, 30 minutes of football is really important to the development of our football team and important to the future of our football team and uh, getting those guys in so we can, we can teach off of that and they can understand the importance of digesting the game plan. Virginia Tech's lunch pail defense did its fair share in the win, holding the tribe's rushing yards to just 34. Eric Johnson will have more on Bud Foster squad on Sunday. In Blacksburg, Alyssa Ray, 10 Sports.